The source and center of all man's creative power is the power of making images or the power of imagination. And on the Art Express, we are always delighted to put your imagination to work. I am Tulope Lamini, your host. Abdul Latif Salahuddin is a visual artist in Nigeria. His art is created to express himself on the positivity of life and his biggest inspiration and aspiration is from God. Let's meet you. I'm a visual artist. My art is created to speak about issues in the society, to address the issues in the society and to speak positivity into it. My art has been a way of me to connect, uh, to address the issue and to express myself in the society, to express uh, my own perspective in the society. I did not study at in any school, but I learned is a thing I choose to, as, a, as my passion. It's a thing I learn, and it's something I love doing. So I decided to go and learn it, have more idea about it. But art is everything to me now. Um, I choose art because I think um, we need positive people in the society, and art is a kind of a kind of creativity that. When people see it, it apart from its beautiful, it's called, it, oh, apart from its beauty, it calls attention, you know, people are able to connect themselves with it when they see it. His artwork is created to heal or change perspective of thinking. His art is made up of love, power and strength, so the connection within his art and human is unique and natural. His goal is to create his view to love, power, relationship and peace with his art. He has also shared his views in exhibition where he did a group exhibition themed Inside Life in 2020 at Vivid Exclusive Art Gallery and he has continued to inspire and motivate people with love and values. The most visible, unique word and language his art expresses is love, positivity and peace, because he believes this is what can make the world work better. My type of art is oil on canvases, which is a place to be serious. It's a spirit a series that talk about self-discovery, discovering yourself, people doing what they are supposed to be doing at, the, at a particular time. It's a series that talk about childhood and good, focusing on a, a on career, on a value at a particular time. <music> Mr. Gabriel of Vivid Exclusive Art Gallery, Mr. Olumi de Ajewole, and so many more. Yes, I've done my exhibition in, that was 2020, the Inside Life Group exhibitions. We have over 30 artists who participate in the exhibition and it was very overwhelming. I've kind of impacted life. I have 
some of my work that just like I said my work is about discovery of, of itself. I have my work that talk about depression and I think I've come across people who happen to change their mindset um, when we talk about depression in society because depression is something that kills more than a hundred or a million people within a year. So people who are going to depression die day by day, day by day. So I just kind of change people's perspective when we talk about the depression. Uh, my motivating factor is creating value to people, creating value in people, making people understand how what life is in another aspect, how they can see life in another aspect, in another angle. Not creating just a straight, not seeing art in just that straight angle, seeing it in a different aspect. Because my work is based on perspective, life, and the setting as a whole. I won't say it's, it's different from any other artist. It's just uh, getting your work out there, selling your work. You know, the message, you can't just keep it for yourself. It's for people out there, for people out there to see. But I would say social media has been a great place that has been supporting young artists to show their talent, to share their works out there. And I would just say you just have to keep working and keep sharing. The heaven is your starting point. So I have my works here from the Place to Be series. Just like I told you, it's a series about um, reconnecting to life, reconnecting to dream, reconnecting to your career, for people to see, to go where they are supposed to be going, to do what they are supposed to be doing. So it's a work about reconnection as a whole. So I have my work here, Honor, from the Place to Be series. Honor uh, is just like on a means road. Honor uh, is a work that is talking about um, young people from the tender age, where whereby our parents, uh, our parents or our guardians tell us to do this and do that. At times, it's a lot. It has a lot to do with discovery when young people are growing up. So this is also my work from the Place to Be series. Um, from the Place to Be series is tied to Irina or no? Seeing road, seeing the main road. So it's just for them to reconnect and see life. At times, life is, you are in a dark aspect of life. Everything is up and so at times, things are made of, life is made of ups and downs. Sometimes things are down, which is the dark aspect in life. Everyone have a down time in their life. So it's just reconnecting. When You know, when you happen to close one eye, you kind of focus, you kind of reconnect to life. It's just a reconnection to life as a whole.